There we are. Yeah. Paparazzi. Pap yes, Paparazzi. Yes. Day three, we are in Cozumel and we have a breakfast with a view. Look at this. How can you beat this? We have yogurt, toast, Danish, fruit plate, OJ, coffee, and a view. We'll show you real quick outside, uh, but it's a beautiful day in Cozumel. So we're going to go uh, to the International Cruise Port, the snack bar of Mandy. We got a little something for them. Maybe check out El Cid. But for now, we're the only carnival ship in port. We uh, do have a Royal Caribbean Mariner of the Seas off to the side. We can show you that. But yeah, we're the only carnival. Yeah, we'll show you. There's the Mariner of the Seas. And look. Down here, if you could see, all the chairs have the towel animals. The invasion of the towel animals. And for those staying on board and not venturing out to Cozumel, you basically have the pool and the hot tub all to yourself. But yeah, over here, there's no other carnival ships. So we were hoping to see maybe Jubilee or you know any of the carnival ships but we're not seeing any and it's 10 a.m so don't see any arriving either so it looks like just us today it's the paradise and mariner of the seas we have some safety drills today the crew are performing and they're actually lowering a lifeboat and then they're working on this one. Yep, and we hope that is the only time we ever see a lifeboat lowered. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> bridge doesn't stick way out like the more modern ones that's why it's hard to see the bridge <laughs> we do have one <laughs> there we are pretty quiet in Cozumel today with only two ships yeah and it almost seems like there's nobody on the ship anymore so <laughs> yeah it would have been perfect, as Andrew was saying, for like a ship tour or, you know. We could still show one maybe We later. could, maybe we'll, yeah. We'll see. But we're seeing the ship now in her full exterior mode. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh yeah, okay. They're still doing the lifeboat drill. Crew. Cool. When you do come off the ship in Cozumel, right to the right, there's three amigos, so you could actually get a bite to eat here. Got a really nice looking view. So, and then there's a Ron John surf shop. Not sure what's happening here, but something. And we got this cool area. We have found dog shirts here for our pups before, so we may look for those when we come back. But they're usually in one of these shops over here, if they have them. Welcome to Puerto Maya, Cozumel, Mexico. So when we are in Cozumel, if we're not doing Mr. Sancho's or Paradise Club, no, what's uh, it Paradise called, Paradise Beach. Beach. Uh, we do like to go next door, International Cruise Port or Royal Caribbean Docks, and we like to visit our friends at Snack Bar Mandy. Great margaritas, great shrimp ceviche, great food. But let's go say hello to them so we have to exit our terminal and walk next door. So here's where we came from. We are just going to exit the Carnival Cruise Terminal. Very, very easy. A lot of places over here to go too, but we're just gonna hang a left. Walk it down. Yeah, International Cruise Terminal right, uh, right on the other side of these walls here. Basically, look at the, <laughs> the ship. ship and yes. then just follow the path. Also to the left here, nice little shopping center, Royal Village, they have a Hard Rock Cafe. Uh, we've shown this in our Independence of the Seas video, you'll have to check that out. A lot of shops. But here's the Royal Terminal. Oh, Casino, we've never been in there. Maybe it's looser slots over here, you never know. All right, there it is, International Cruise Terminal. We're just gonna go right in here. All right, we're now on the Royal Caribbean side, International Cruise Port. There is the Mariner of the Seas. I believe she's the same class as Independence of the Seas, which we have been on that ship. And there's a Senior Frogs here. And for those who don't know, you could actually swim right here, free of charge. Yeah, this is cool. You just take this right down. We have snorkeled in here before. You see a lot of fish. And then you have a great view of the ship. Our good friends. Oh yeah, there we go. It's a video. It's a video. It's okay. Welcome one more time. Welcome one more. Yep, welcome, welcome. Yeah, bienvenido una vez más. Thank you. Paparazzi. Pap yes, paparazzi. Yes. Here, we... Bienvenido, paparazzi. <laughs> okay, the wonderful staff at Snack Bar Mandy. If you're in Cozumel, come here to eat. Best food, best drink, best staff. All right, all right. <laughs> yeah. Original staff. And don't forget our caps, okay? Bring them a baseball cap. They collect baseball caps. Yeah. You have your hats. Your hat, yes, yes. Yes. And then the big guy gets, he gets this one. Ah, the head of the sanero. To give him this one. You like the pattern now? Yes. Okay, I use about this now today. Okay. Yes. There it is. Representing home. Right there. Woo! Uh, Taco, <laughs> right. And here we'll get. Video del paparazzi. Here we'll get one here too. <laughs> so 
dice, Snack Bar Mandy is the best. Hola. Está grabando. La uno. Mandy. Thank you guys. Look at our drinks here. I have a margarita. And I have a virgin mango daiquiri. It's amazing. Cheers. And she gave Andy extra tequila, so wow. wait for the heartburn. She did. Glad it has a lot of salt. But this poll is reminding me of another video we did. We may have to splice in a quick little clip of how the poll tripped us up. DJI wanted to focus on this poll and we were out of focus. Okay, so mint julep, it's our go-to. We just showed you where you got it at Casey's. Cheers. Good? Yeah. Look at what we have. Oh, Thank you. Look at this, everybody. This is just picture, picture perfect. This is why we come here. Well, and the great people. All right, I may have put together the perfect little bite. Avocado, shrimp, ceviche, a little bit of the sauce right there, and a chip. Good. Now. <laughs> hey! We have your hat. Thank you yeah. so much. Thank you. you thank used you. Used to say, "Where's my hat?" Yeah. Because <laughs> you. you were wearing that Cubs hat, so we yeah. had to fix that. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three. Hey. Six. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said six. Oh. <laughs> I said six. Snack bar, Mandy, the place to go. Right? Best yeah. people, best food. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And a new friend. Yeah. Yes. Okay. 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 All right, so there's International Cruise Terminal. Literally right next door is El Cid. So we're going to go in and see if we could get a la carte instead of a day pass. All right, you just come through the lobby. Look at the pool here. And we got a good view of the ships. And inside here, a little restaurant. So they said it was 25 just for uh, the pool and one hour and the restaurant, but all you could eat and drink, 65. We're gonna do the 25. Okay, so super easy, $25 for like one, two hours as long as you want. But you do get for $25 a $13 credit in the restaurant. Yeah, for and food could, or drink. Yeah, and you could use their snorkeling, their pool, uh, whatever you want to use. So, and then the other option we define is 65 all inclusive, all inclusive. All you can eat and drink. Right. Yeah, but we're just here for a short, we have an hour and a half before getting on board, so we're just spending an hour here, check out yeah. the pool, so come on! And we will link uh, El Cid in the description. I hope it's not too cold. Oh yeah, this is easy to get in. All right, we're gonna like this. Okay, we are in the pool. It is very easy to get in. And look at how much we almost had the pool to ourselves. Yeah, so the water is lovely. And all we gotta do is just walk right over here if we wanna get in the ocean. And it looks like they got beach volleyball. They have plenty of loungers. See if I can show you. If you want somewhere to walk and you don't need a taxi, El Cid is your place. All right, we have a, a margarita and another mango. Another mango! Look 
Exactly. All right, look at this guy. Don't worry, friend. Wow. How cool is that? Okay, we switched to water type mode, so excuse us if there's wind noise, but look at this area. Great, great view of the ship up, oh, and there's our carnival ship in the distance. Here's our beach access, looks a little rocky. Okay, so the beach, what I can say about the beach, definitely rocky and it's a little hard to get in. You can step, and this is slippery below me, but you can definitely see some fish, so. And we're nice and cool. We just wanted to get in the ocean, but you definitely have to be very, very careful getting down these steps. It's crazy. I think we're done. Our ship leaves at 3.30. We just wanted to get in the ocean, but yeah. which you can do here. But it's a little dicey, slippery. Yeah. And it gets a little chaotic with the waves, but they do have a rope and like railings you can hold on to. Yeah, so. and a heck of a view. Yeah. And a little foot wash station. There you go. That's the way to do it. Get all that, that is, sand <laughs> That is the way. Look at this pool. You could have it all to yourself. Woo! Wow! Ah. Ah, lovely, lovely pool. All right. And look, I currently have it all to myself. I think if we stayed a weekend, definitely would want to pick this building here and ask for a high up room overlooking the ship. All right, here's a little more of the resort. Look, they have a swim up hot tub. So adult only. Adult only hot tub, but there it's, it's right there along the bar. Swim up bar hot tub. How about that? But we just ordered food. We'll show you that shortly. But look at our view behind Andrea. We have our ship, the Paradise. We have another ship uh so yeah this is lovely we have an hour and a half till back on board so we just ordered food we got to make this quick and get back on board we don't like to cut it close <laughs> no. look at the nachos that looks wonderful steak or beef nachos guacamole and we do have uh, pico de gallo Lovely. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's good. Mm. All right. These are really good nachos. The beef is good and flavorful. Guacamole. So, highly recommend.
we're currently leaving El Cid. We can definitely recommend this place. And it's somewhere you could walk to from either cruise port yeah. and not spend a ton. Have good food, good drinks. Yeah, so. and then a, a pool almost to yourselves. And then a beach area, hot tub if you want it. It sounded a little hot. But, but we got right. an hour, so let's book it. Hour to get back to the ship. Hmm. Got some nice merch here. Those are called fifteen dollars. We're looking for our puppy shirts. Nice looking shirts, actually. Two for twenty-two. All right, new dog shirts. Another good shot of the ship. The reveal shot. Right back to the ship. I think we made it <laughs> back in time. Yeah. Yes, we did well. We did everything we wanted, but look at the girl. Yeah, we had a lovely day with food, friends, and then a new resort. That's right. She's actually a good looking ship for being second oldest in Carnival's fleet. Look at it. Very lovely. It's the right way. Huh. And we were greeted by the cruise director. Here she is, she does have balconies. And this cruise so far, we have done all stairs. But it's day three, so not difficult. We've done all stairs on a seven day. But here, we're on deck three. We're going all the way up to the water slides. Oh, we're only on five. Ah. We are back on board. We just did the steps all the way up to 11. But there's nobody here at the slide, so. Look at all these chairs open. It's it's crazy. Yeah, we're gonna try these slides, but yeah, look at all these. Getting a good view. Hi there. All right, just did this slide. Can't use a GoPro. It's got to be a wrist mount, but I could tell you it was fast. It was refreshing. So, whew. Andrea's turn. Yeah, Andrea's heading to the top now. She's heading down. It's a long course. It's a long way down. Did you like it? I did. All right. I went light a lot slower than you did. A little bit. 
All right, we'll try the racing ones. Okay, they, they're coming up. Welcome to my blocks. She may have had a head start. Head start. <laughs> yes. maybe, maybe you give her a head start. Oh, <laughs> oh, definitely, right, yes. Right. Thank you. Thank you. All right, we're back on board was 3.30. It's now like 3.55, so not seeing any pier runners, but they're about 25 minutes after back on board time. But look at the waters in Cosmo. The light blue, dark blue, turquoise way up there. Hopefully they're coming out. So, so cool. Yeah, we were just over there. El Cid is right up there. Okay, we have three people still ashore and they're... He's got papers. Yep. They're calling it. Three people still ashore. So three people will be left behind in Cosmo. There goes the gangway. Where's that? The three people will have to find another way to Tampa. We found our missing three stragglers. Here they come. They don't have to run. <laughs> Lucky them. Oh, did they ever look out? Two ropes are down. Two ropes down. Here they come. I think it's all three of them. They are very lucky. Yes. All right, those three extremely lucky. That was pulled in. The ropes were almost all dropped. Oh, lucky. <laughs> Everybody, uh, so we had a long day in Cosimo. We're feeling refreshed after a shower. Cold ice water. Oh yes. But we're getting ready to check in for dinner, and um, yeah. So we'll show you our I food. Think we're next, ready. But... All right, well, nothing new for me, but Andrea. Wow, what is that? I have stuffed mushrooms, and it's almost like a mushroom avocado tasting sauce. Well, it looks delightful, colorful. Mm -hmm. 
All right, we have an Italian pepper steak. It's supposed to be tenderloin. I'll report back if it is. Peppers, onions, rice, Andrea. Oh my gosh. So I have, I went out of my box, artichoke potato cheesecake. And just look at the cheese pull. <laughs> yeah, a lot of cheese. So I like any type of potato style that's not baked. Hopefully it's delicious. Oh yeah, that's good. Wow. Cool. And then this is the, um, it's like a fried artichoke that goes with it. So we all know what artichokes are. Oh, nice. And I don't know what this is. Maybe it's, the, oh, this is the, um, it's a sweet chipotle sauce that goes on top of Ooh, it. Oh, well, I might have a kick then. Yeah, that's what she was saying. Is that like a cheddar sauce? Or yeah. Cheese of some sort? It's, it tastes like hash browns or something. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, good stuff. We'll check back in with you, and I'll let you all know about this. It does look really good. We know last night's dinner for me was a mess. I had two entrees, and I didn't like either, and that wasn't like carnival lately, because day one dinner was so awesome. But this looks better, and so far, everything's been great. So I could already tell you this entree way better than both I tried last night. Last night I tried chicken corn and blue that was in this and then the prime rib was really fatty. Uh, so, but this is like a tenderloin, beef tenderloin, very tender, very flavorful sauce and onions and peppers and mushrooms, very good. So much, much better. And Andrea, still enjoying yours? Yes. And I even like the sweet chipotle sauce that I thought was going to be too spicy, but it has just enough sweet spice to it. Awesome. All right. Next stop, dessert. Mine is just tiramisu. I can tell you it's fantastic, as always. Andrea got something new, though. Yes. I got the Bartlett pear. So that's what that is. Pear oh. almond cake with like a pumpkin sauce so I don't know it oh, looks lovely dredge it through that yeah so mm. it does have a little pumpkin like spice cake to it I don't know I like it I'll have to get further into it and let you and know I guess that's like a raspberry yeah something. I think raspberry and then like um custard oh yeah so that's like a custard Ooh. oh that would be really good raspberry or strawberry no it's like the jelly from like a jelly donut so it's raspberry Ooh, sweet and then vanilla pumpkin oh yeah looks good Ooh. all right it is good all right here we go It was good. very, very good. Yeah, both were really good. Cheers. Ooh. Chocolatini. It's been a while. Yeah. Yum as always. Very, very good. All right. Well, it almost tastes like it's like a minty type. Ooh.
You're the only one who really knew me at all. So take a look at me now. There's just an empty space. To the end of day three we were in Cozumel we had a fabulous time at snack bar Mandy got to give our friends their St. Louis hats they loved them once again the food was awesome finally made it to El Cid and ocean was not eh, something rememberable <laughs> but the pool the food, drinks, everything else. We actually talked to some people that actually stayed at the resort and on the ship and they highly recommend it. They said the rooms are awesome, great AC, food, and everything with the resort. So we will definitely be checking that out. Um, came back on board, had a great dinner at uh, the main dining room, way better than Andy's meal they had last night. We went to the piano bar. That was a lot of fun. I got to hear two Phil Collins songs. We went to the 80s glow party on the Lido deck. That was awesome with uh, cruise director Amber. So thanks for coming along. Tomorrow is another sea day and then we're back home. So don't forget to give us a thumbs up and please hit that subscribe button. See you tomorrow, day four.